For this project, we're going to be making a Christmas ornament. And the first thing that you need to do is create a pattern. Now, if you're doing this here at school, you'll be given a few patterns to choose from. If you're doing it at home, you can print out a picture of a pattern or you can draw your own. And what you need to end up with is half of an ornament. So you can see here that I have half of an ornament. Then you need to have two types of paper. You could use two colors of paper, or I've chosen green, and then paper that has Christmas carols printed on it. You could use an old, old book pages, magazine pages, newspaper, whatever you'd like to use. And at school, we're using six by six pieces. Um, you need to stick kind of around that size if you're doing this at home, but whatever size works for your supplies is fine. Then what you need to do is take your paper and fold it in half, and you'll have nine of each color. And you just fold them in half, and it will be tempting because there's 18 to cut out. You're going to be tempted to do lots of them at a time, but I would suggest that you only do up to two together at a time. It really is hard to cut big stacks of paper neatly. So you could put them together like this if you'd like and cut up to two pieces. And you can see I'm just going to cut on my pencil line. I am not cutting the fold. And be as neat as you can. The final product looks so much nicer if you've been neat each step along the way. So now you can see I have green and I have my Christmas Carol pieces. So I would need to end up with nine of each. Now I've already cut mine out and I've gotten started on the next step. The next step is to glue all of your pieces together. You fold them in half like a book And then you take your glue and you coat the whole side. After you do that, you take the folded piece and put that on top. And you can see I now have all of my pieces glued together in a stack. It's important that you don't glue inside the fold. If you think of this like a book, and this is the cover, and this is the inside of a book, you don't want to glue the inside of a book. You just glue your pieces together. So then I need to glue my next piece. say I have all my pieces now. After you have them all glued in a nice stack, then you need to put glue on the very top one. Pull it around and glue it to the bottom one. So you see this is the top, this is the bottom. I'm pulling this around and I have to kind of maneuver it a little bit to try to line it up. I glue that together and I have something that looks like this. So now what I need you to do is to take your pieces, cut them out, glue them together, and end up with something like this. Then go on to the next video and I will show you what to do.